Today I'm gonna share with you nine tips how you as a chef can move up in the restaurant and hotel industry coming right up. Hey what's cooking guys Marcel here again from Slamming It Out. Thank you for watching this video. I'm a professional chef and author and in today's video I'm gonna share with you nine tips how you as a chef can move up in the restaurant and hotel industry. But before I do, I would like you to consider to subscribe to my channel if you find this content useful and interesting. All right, I'm gonna give you the nine tips how, in my opinion, you can move up as a chef in the industry. Tip number one is, of course, the desire to move up. You want to have the strong desire to become and grow. If you don't have that desire, you'll probably stick around for the next 40 years in the same position. That's not what you want. This is not what I wanted when I was a younger chef. Tip number two, definitely you need a lot of willpower to achieve your goals. No willpower, you will not much achieve anything. Uh, tip number three, read cookbooks. This is what I was doing and still doing today. Uh, read books, they are very useful. And it brings me already to uh, point number four, uh, watch YouTube videos. Today we have YouTube, we didn't have that uh, 20 years ago when I was a younger chef. Watch this video, there are plenty of useful videos, great videos, and then practice what you have watched at home or in the kitchen. Uh, tip number five, at work, if you are working in a professional kitchen, of course, ask your boss, ask your supervisor to train you, to teach you. This is very important. They have all the knowledge, or um, at least they should have uh, the knowledge. So go bother them, get on their nerves, ask them. This is what they're there for. They are there that you squeeze out all the information you need and want. Tip uh, number six. Apply for the position you want to work. Of course, if let's say you want to become, if you are a rookie, if you are a young chef and you just start out and you want to become an executive chef, okay, it doesn't make sense to apply for an executive chef. That makes sense because you don't have the experience. What I mean is that um, when you start, don't wait too long. Don't work uh, too long in one position. Yeah, as a young chef, as a commie chef, you work one or two years in this position. If you really want to uh, grow and you have the desire and the willpower and you want to grow up, you automatically actually don't waste much time because you push it. So this is what I did. I always applied for the next higher position. When I was a commie chef, I worked one or two years in this position and I know I wanted to grow. So the next job I would apply for a demi chef position. And after uh, one or two years working as a demi chef, I applied for a chef de party position. And normally I always got uh, the success. They always hired me in this position. You know, if you really want, then you also get what you want. Of course, later on, you need to uh, prove that you uh, uh, were worth it, the hiring, that you were worth the, the decision to hire you. Tip number seven, uh, similar to uh, tip number six, don't work too long at one place, maximum one or two years. Uh, hop around, don't waste your time and get comfortable because comfortability is your enemy. Tip number eight, patience. Yeah, I'm saying you have to hop around and don't wait too long, but you also need to be patient and the time will, because the time will come when things are not going according to your will and your plan. So develop patience, work on your goals, work for your goals with strong desire and willpower and then the things will fall into place. Number nine. Uh, also very important, persistence. You know, you want to be persistent in following through on your goals at the same time, like I mentioned already, be patient. And if you follow these nine tips, then uh, uh, success is not guaranteed because this is not what I'm doing here in my videos. I don't promise or guarantee anything, but these nine tips 
I have used in my own life, personal life and career. And the chances are higher that you will become uh, successful. That means you are moving up in the uh, hotel and restaurant industry. All right, I hope these nine tips made sense to you. If yes, let me know in the comment section below. And if not, then also just drop me a comment. And if you like this video, just give me a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give me a thumbs down. I don't really care as long as you give me a thumbs. And also guys, why don't you come over uh, to my website www.marcelrima.co. Here you can find many more videos, my blog and also this beautiful thing here, my book, it's called Slamming It Out. It's all about cooking. It's all about becoming a chef. It's all about becoming a professional chef with lot of, lots of uh, tips, tricks and other tools. The book is available on Amazon and Kindle. And now guys, thank you for watching this video. Wishing you a great day ahead. See you, take care and bye bye.